Ever since I was younger, I was into video games. Somebody like the views so I can bring bad news to all these crews who can't NBA jam with the shoes. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another beer review. Uh, we are getting towards the end of the answer week. <laughs> uh, and we are going to be re uh, reviewing another popsicle beer um, from the answer, Richmond, Virginia, courtesy of my man Matt. Thank you so much, sir. Uh, this is double raspberry popsicle, and this is three and a half percent. It says popsicle style smoothie with double red raspberries and pink sea salt. So um, I've enjoyed all of the juice beers I've had from the answer. <laughs> These beers have been really fun, um, and my wife has been enjoying them too. So. I'm excited to uh, to check this one out. Uh, my man Jonathan from Beautiful Beer Reviews, I always wanna call him Justin because he looks like my old roommate Justin, um, reviewed this and he loved it. Said it basically smelled and tasted like a, uh, what did he say, a melted Welch's popsicle? So, the color of this is insane, wait till you guys see it. <laughs> it's so crazy. We're using our uh, Yoshi answer glass because it's probably the coolest glass that I own and the color of this beer is crazy it is straight like magenta <laughs> it is like it's so pink it's amazing there is again with this one uh, just like the cream school beer we just reviewed there's a million tiny bubbles uh, sticking to the glass um, and the head on that is like it's this crazy pink like it's looks so amazing that color that glass where are you kidding me GTFO that is fire so uh, I love me some raspberries raspberry sours are one of my favorite this is not a sour this is a goza but um, I just I love 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 fruited beers with raspberry so let's shove our nose in this one yeah I mean it it smells like <laughs> it smells like fresh raspberries when he said it smells like <laughs> it smells like a melted popsicle like when a, a popsicle melts and like it goes down on your fingers and it gets all sticky that's <laughs> That does, I mean, that's a great um, note. I mean, that's what it smells like. It's seedy, it's jammy. Um, there's a little bit of like a salty thing, but it's it's so dominated by raspberry. There's a little bit of tartness. It doesn't uh, smell sour at all. It just, it's that like raspberry, like dripping raspberry kind of tartness that the fruit offers. So this smells so good. Let's taste it, Matt. Cheers. Thank you, sir. It smells, it, I mean, it smells. It tastes exactly like Jonathan said. It tastes like a Welch's um, popsicle. That's, that's so nuts. Um, this says smoothie style beer. We did the, I think Shannon Spiker was a smoothie that had, I think there was like blood oranges and apricots. That one was much like thicker of a mouthfeel. It was actual like smoothie consistency. This is more like the, um, shoot, what was it? Brian Henry popsicle, the first one. It, this has that like juice box consistency. And it's got a little bit of that. It says with sea salt, it's got that kind of salty thing on the finish that you typically get from a Goza. Uh, but it's not, it's not like over the top salty, and this is definitely not sour. There's a little bit of that fruity kind of tartness, but again, this tastes like a juice box. It tastes like high C or one of those juice boxes you used to drink as a kid. These beers are crazy. They're really, really fun. Um, I've had four of them now, and I love all of them. I will say, I think I like the, um, We've had two, one was passion fruit and raspberry, and this one's raspberry. I think I like the raspberry and passion fruit ones more than the, the ones that had like peaches and oranges. Um, I just, it's a preference. I like the more of the tartness of these fruits. It's just fruit that I eat and put in smoothies more than um, I do with peaches and mangoes and apricots. Like I eat those fruits every now and again, but um, like raspberry, blueberry, berries are my wheelhouse when it comes to fruited beers. And this is, this is probably my favorite one I've had so far. It's awesome. It tastes like a, 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 a raspberry popsicle. It's exactly what it tastes like. So, um, on is nailing these flavors, and I guess it's easy to do that when you're putting actual fruit puree into a beer. Like, it's just gonna take on that flavor. It's just, it's, it's really. I, I've said it every review. It's crazy what you taste. What it says on the label is exactly what you're tasting. 
Um, and it's not like a kind of taste like that. It's, that's exactly what it is. This is another beer that if, if you let, like left this <laughs> sitting out and your kid walked up and drew, like they would chug this. There's no, it's, it's not alcohol. It's not beer. It's raspberry juice. So, um, again, I mean, if I was to put a numeric grade on this one out of all the ones that we've had, this would be like the 100 out of 100. They're all A pluses. It's exactly what it's advertised on the label. Excuse me. It tastes exactly what they're saying it is. And they're three and a half percent. I love that. So Matt, you're a saint. I so appreciate you sending these. Uh, so yeah, that's double raspberry obstacle from the answer. If you guys had it, leave a comment below. Let me know what you think. As always, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you very soon. Cheers. Ever since I was younger, I was into video games. Somebody like the fuse so I can bring bad news to all these crews who can't NBA jam with the shoe.